Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. So I just left my OBGYN appointment. I mean, it wasn't really about me. I had to go pick up some results for my husband. Okay, okay. Um, honestly, I truly can't wait till this part is over. All the tests and the this and the that, like. But this was one of the last tests that we wanted to do until we just leave the rest to the good lord but yeah we're gonna take a few months off of like testing and we're not necessarily worrying but like trying to figure out what's going on i think we have all of the answers that we're gonna need for right now so we're just gonna wait a little bit until we have to do anything else just to see see what god do you know what i'm saying but anyways and first of all i don't understand why that appointment couldn't have been an email a phone call you know a zoom because what that was 75 dollars for literally her to she spoke to me for two minutes and was like, all right, so best of luck, <laughs> you know? No, like, no shade. I love, I love my gynecologist. And really, there was nothing much, much more for her to say, but I just wish that could have been a quick little, hey, girl, so this is what's going on type of thing. But anyhow, now I'm at Walgreens. I need to take my passport picture because not only did I change my last name, but also my passport expires July 18th. I'm going to make it July 22nd. Today is June 19th, so I had to pay for an expedited um, passport and all that stuff. Blah, 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 you know, last minute tings over here. And we're also leaving to go to LA in two days. I have so much that still needs to be done. So here's what I need to get done still. My hair is getting done today. I have to wash it when I get home. I have a YouTube videos I need to edit. I have the podcast I need to edit because we're trying to get ahead since we're not going to be here next week. And we're supposed to record another podcast episode tomorrow. I don't see that happening. Um, I got my nail appointment tomorrow. So hair appointment tonight, nail appointment tomorrow, wax appointment tomorrow. I have a uh, sponsored content that's due tomorrow that I haven't even started recording yet. I need to pick up my dress from the alterations place. I did want to go shopping a little bit. We're going to be in LA for 10 days and I'm like, do I even have enough draws for 10 days? I need 20 pairs. You need two a day just in case. <laughs> oh my gosh. But everything's going to be fine. Whether I get to go shopping or get my nails done or not. Only thing I'm really concerned about is getting my hair done. Hmm? And picking up my dress. Y'all, I can't wait for you to see the dress that I chose. It's beautiful. It's so like, it's like elegant, still kind of sexy. And when I got it altered yesterday, I was like, can y'all put a slit in this? Cause that would just take it all the way up. I'm a slit girl. Like I like for my dress to be like nice and covered and stuff, but like let my leg pop out, pop it out. Okay. And I need that wax appointment. The only things I really care about is my hair, my dress and that wax. I could put press ons on if I need to, or have no nails. I don't really care, but <laughs> I need to be balding. You know what I'm saying? Anyways. All right, let's go take this picture. Cause then I need to go back home, get all the things I need to get and then drop off my picture and stuff too the post office so I can send it in because I also have to send in my like marriage certificate to prove that I changed my last name and I have to send in my old passport and blah 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 y'all they didn't let me smile with my teeth and why is my 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 um my hair kind of lopsided but it is what it is y'all let's just get this passport okay complete and sign this form all right we can do that I need a pen attach a one color photograph that's this. Your previously issued passport. This. Supporting documents. Marriage certificate. Mail us your application and attachments. Okay, I can do that. Y'all, I can't lie. Hair and makeup is eating. It's eating. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. -mm. Yeah, it's eating. And so am I. Oh. 
Okay. <laughs> All right, y'all, I just washed my hair. But tell me how I went to the post office today swearing that I was about to be so responsible, get my passport and stuff in, and I pull up and I'm like, wow, there's not a lot of people here. Baby, it's Juneteenth. There's nobody there, okay? Only people who were there were just dropping things off like in the mailbox, but there were no workers there because today is Juneteenth. They were off today. Not my husband though, my husband at work. His boss said he watched my content too. Hey boss, nothing against you, but hello? Oh, okay. So, um, yeah, I just washed my hair, but y'all, my hair appointment is at 6:30. And thank you, Lord Jesus. She's coming to my house to do my hair. Even though she has a um, she has a like a, a chair, you know what I mean? Like at a place. But I think she's doing me a favor because it's also it's like my friend Brianna, y'all know Brie. It's her cousin. And I think she's doing me a favor because she's starting my hair at 6.30 p.m. You know, like this definitely gives after hours. And she was like, girl, I got you. I'll be there at 6.30. So we love a good house call. But like I said, she's supposed to be at here at 6.30. She texts me at 5 saying, hey, love. You know, hey, love always gets me. She said, hey, love, I'm on my way. I'm going to be early. And I was like, oh, 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 I'm not ready. Hair ain't dried. I had like a little reel I wanted to do with like the process. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. But yeah, I'll take a hey love, I'm coming early over a hey love, can we your schedule text any day? So come on over, girl. I am not mad. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Did I put on deodorant? Speaking of deodorant, update on the salt hair deodorant. You guys, I can't do it, I'm sorry. It was going well. I didn't bring it to Disney because I was afraid to test it that much, even though that was a good time to test it. But, well, when did I get my dress altered? I think yesterday, yeah. Yesterday I went to get my dress altered and when I woke up in the morning and I woke up and my armpits were a little <laughs> hmm, A little questionable and I had taken a shower the night before so I was like Well, that's not good. So yeah, I taken a shower the night before I put on this deodorant I woke up Tuesday morning. I'm like my armpits don't smell good They don't smell good. Okay, so I'm like, okay, so I wiped them out and I put on another layer I'm like, let's try this again. I'm going to get my dress altered like I live I go throughout my day, I go to get my dress altered, I'm starting to smell my armpits again, and I'm so uncomfortable because the lady is like telling me to raise my arm, she's getting like all close up, I need to shave my armpits, she's getting like all close up under here to like pin my dress, and I'm just like, oh my gosh, I know she's probably like, you know what, these black people stink, <laughs> girl, it's not me. So yeah, I'm gonna have to give up on this. I'm back to my dangerous deodorant. I'm sorry, I gotta smell good. I have to, so then Jonathan came home early, and I was like, oh my gosh, babe, smell me. And I take my hygiene and my scent very seriously. He's like, Jess, I'm not gonna lie, I don't ever wanna smell you like that again. <laughs> Cause he's always talking about how I always smell good. Like I take pride in my cleanliness and smelling like a nice young, yummy girl. Speaking of, it's almost over you guys, it's, it's going down. But actually Finery, they emailed me and they asked um, if they could send me some more. And I was like, yes. Uh, Okay, can I just say, I think I said this before, but sorry I'm rambling. Oh, my eyes. Ever since I started being serious about my short form content when I had that little conversation with you guys, vlogs ago, it's been, it's been getting me noticed. Anyway, all right, I'm getting my hair done. Let me get ready. Okay. Oh, I use Fenty hair on my hair to wash it again and it smells so good. Get this hair blow dried. Oh, I wish you, I wish I knew like what time she was gonna get here because saying I'm coming early, but texting me an hour and a half early, it just like, are you coming an hour and a half early? Or are you coming an hour early, 45 minutes, 30 minutes, 15? I would just like to know how much time I have. I'm fine with you coming early. I just like, what time, you know? Like, are you downstairs right now? Or are you 45 minutes away still? These are the questions. Oh, I didn't put a leave-in conditioner in. Whoops. My hair is done. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, 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 uh. 
<laughs> yeah, we finished at like three o'clock in the morning last night, but hair is done. The side, I've been playing around with different styles like all day, but like I'm actually running late. Now I need to go get a wax. Here's what we're doing today. I packed a little bit this morning. I edited a little bit this morning. I'm praying this vlog goes up today because if it doesn't go up today, it'll be three weeks without a vlog and that's crazy for me. All right, let's walk and talk. But yeah, did a little bit of packing, a little bit of trying on clothes. Guys, we're leaving tomorrow and it's just been such a busy week that I just feel so, 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 so behind. I still have to stop by the post office to drop off my passport stuff, so I gotta bring that. Hold on. Okay, I'm in the car now, so what am I doing? So now I'm on my way to my wax appointment and I'm dreading this because uh, when you skip one month, just prepare to just not be having a good time at all. So that's that. And right after my wax appointment, I have to go to my nail appointment to get these girls done because mm -mm. Um, after my nail appointment, I have to I have my fitting appointment for my dress that I got altered at 3.30. But I just need to make sure I make it to the post office before five because I need to, so wait, green light. I need to make sure I drop this off today because by the time we get back home, it's gonna be July 2nd, my trip's July 22nd. It's cutting it too close, so I, it needs to go out today. Today, today, today. Thank God, Jonathan helped me out last night he washed all the clothes because I did not have time to do that last night I was getting my hair done from 6 30 p.m. to th 3 a.m. all right y'all we made it to my death chamber and I'm on time <sighs> it's over that wasn't that bad, but, whoo, Jesus. Okay, on to the next appointment. I've been running, running, running. Let me see how far away my next appointment is. 24 minutes, yep, time to go. Okay, whoo, all right, now it's 3.30. I just got my nails done. Oh, you can't see. Ah, there we go. These are so cute. Every time I get my nails done, I'm like, this is the best that I've ever gotten, just because I just, I love, actually having my nails done but now I'm going to pick up oh I'm right at a barbershop I was like where are all these why are all these men here I'm going to pick up my dress I have to find the little receipt they gave me oh it was at three shoot I thought it was 3 30 crap I'm not doing good today guys I thought my appointment was at 3 30 whoopsies um all right let's go pick up this dress I hope they didn't mess it up I hope it's perfect oh my god You guys, my dress looks amazing. My dress looks so good. They did a really good job. They did, they did what they needed to do. They did what they needed to do. I have a little headache right now. And I know it's because I haven't had breakfast yet and it's 3.48. No food in sight. I'm starving. But I need to go to the post office real quick to drop off my passport stuff. I cannot go to California without doing that or else I'm toast. So I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna bore you guys with that nonsense, but I cannot wait to get back home. Cause guess who's waiting for me at home? A husband with a fresh haircut. Don't play with me. You already know when it's fresh haircut season, <laughs> I gotta go. You know what I'm saying? Like, I need to get home ASAP. A-S-A-P. Hello? Let's not waste any time. The hair's growing back as we speak. I need it while it's fresh. Both of us got haircuts today, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> okay, bye.
we're here. Pan back. All right, guys, we made it to California. So right now, it's not really giving huge vibes because as soon as we got here, Jonathan and my friend Bree. So okay, wait. Let's start over. So we're here for a friend's wedding. Our friend is getting married tomorrow. My husband is a groomsman. So the problem with this Airbnb, we're only staying in here for three days. We're here for 10 days, but we're in this Airbnb for three days. And then we're gonna be hopping around from city to city. But it's eight of us, one bathroom, one mirror, Okay, so these are the options for tonight. Originally, I was planning on wearing this dress, but I'm the type of girl who likes to coordinate with what my friend is wearing, and her outfit is a little more casual than this. So I think I'm gonna go with this dress, just so we're kind of on the same page. I'm not one to like be doing too much if the whole group's not doing too much. So maybe I'll save this with for like a dinner with me and Jonathan or something, and then I'll just wear this. Hopefully it fits, because last time I put it on, it didn't fit, but let's try. <laughs> we went on a date, guys. We did our first date. Our first date. We left our men's at home. Ladies, leave your man at home. Food was a 10 out of 10, by the way. That food was so good. In Cali, y'all need to come eat at this type of. It was like, so good. It was so good. The hype, you know how TikTok be hyping stuff and they don't be for real? They got that one right. Period. Hi, I got the girls. Sit in. Talk to me, guys. Okay, bye. <laughs> All right, guys, we um ditched the Airbnb and we went to my in-laws hotel room <laughs> And it's so big <laughs> They let us use their bathroom to get ready. So we're gonna get ready in here. This bathroom's literally the size of our Airbnb <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at the mirror space Ooh, and our matching shirt One thing about me, I'm a matching my friends <laughs> I see my father in the back. Father in law, he's me. so cute. <laughs> he's officiating the wedding. That's his new thing. I'm trying to tell you. Part time. How many weddings have you officiated? In the past three years, maybe 12. Gosh, Lee. If y'all need somebody, call. <laughs> call him <them> up. <laughs> All right. Let's get ready. Mm -hmm. One match over. <laughs> My mother-in-law acting shy. She's so cute. Look at her. <laughs> so cute. Y'all, if you're looking up the definition of unprepared, I'm there, okay? If you're looking up the definition of prepared times two, Bree's there, okay? Now, how, you're like a like but so different. So different. <laughs> Why are my eyelashes not on yet? They should have been on before I even got on the flight. <laughs> but I just knew, I know that Jonathan hates makeup, so I was like, Saving give me the God. light. Yeah, I'm like, give me light makeup. I think over time, like, it, Jonathan just kind of like getting used to it, but we got a new angle. All right, I just did my lashes. I wish I went a little longer. I was a little nervous, but this will do.
Good morning, you guys. Um, it's been a few days since I've seen you. We'll talk about that later. But we're going on a hike, and I'm very ex well. <laughs> I'm excited, but I'm also scared. Okay. I'm also excited, but also scared. Yeah, this is something Jonathan has been talking about for a long time. We're going to Yosemite, of course. It wouldn't be me if I didn't get sick on vacation, so I am feeling a little off, but nothing a good hike can't fix. So we're on our way, and I just thought I'd start the vlog back up so you guys can see all the views, because I'm assuming it's going to be very beautiful. But yeah, it's it five o'clock. Yeah, for all that, we're gonna, you guys, the drive. Uh, I'll update you guys later. Let's just focus on this hike. <laughs> the tunnel? Yeah, here oh, we this? go! It's this! Whoa. Watch this not be the one. That's it. Oh my gosh. What? It's going to be full. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> We're at our first stop, you guys. It's hard to see, but it's gorgeous. Look. See, you guys, this is why it's important to marry someone who's a little bit different than you, because if I married someone who was the same as me, we wouldn't be up here right now. <laughs> it's lovely. Your shoes untied. Oh, so is mine. Right, you guys we're officially starting oh shoot oh officially starting our hike we have our little walking sticks we are in the sticks the woods for sure i mean it got me out here doing white people stuff dog this is crazy we are the only out here okay so if you never hear from us again you already know what time it is how you feeling babe like i want to find where we're going <laughs> <laughs> yeah we're both excited oh we got to put on our outdoor walk on our phone our watch ah. <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys know how long this takes. I've done a hike before in Atlanta, but it was like an hour. This one's three, maybe more actually, because to even get to our hiking spot, we have to walk through. it's like an hour walk to get to where we're hiking. Y'all, please it is a hiking thing. keep me in your prayers. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's get to it. Here's our first sighting. Look at this. Water. Look at this. Wow. That is crazy. I don't be outside. So things like this are like really life changing for me. <laughs> it's gorgeous. Christy Trail. Let's get it. All right, checking in. We're 30 minutes into our hike. Oh, I'm tired. <laughs> Guys, if we didn't have these walking sticks, I don't know how the other people are doing it, but I can't do it without that. But we passed so many nice like um, waterfalls and what do you call those river? It's not a river. What is that? Creeks. Creeks. <sighs> but yeah, all that food I've been eating this trip is getting worked off right now, and we barely just begun. <laughs> Let's go. This is what it's looking like up there. It's gorgeous. Look at Johnny. Exhausted. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> but look. Wait, let me get a good view. The view is just crazy. What is this? It just keeps going up. <laughs> it does keep going up, y'all. <laughs> oh my god.
Way easier, but I almost died. Not lunch. God, this is crazy. It's just so pretty. I can't stop taking pictures of the same exact thing with a different angle. <laughs> just been sitting on this rock for the past like 30 minutes. Just looking at the same thing, but it just keeps looking different. It's like the Bible. Yeah, yeah. The weather, the weather is like beautiful too. Like it's beautiful. so nice. So yeah, this hike took us an hour and a half. That's what my watch said. Yeah, about. Well, that's also including um, the walk, the walk the to get here, yeah. But from the car to the top, it took an hour and a half. And it said we're up like a, a thousand plus elevation. Crazy. But like beautiful. Ten out of ten recommend for real. But it was kinda hard though, I can't lie. No, it was hard. It was hard. <laughs> it was so hard. It was so hard. Oh, oh man. my gosh. Oh my gosh. That yeah, was crazy. Sitting here partially because I love it. <laughs> and partially because I'm afraid to go back down. <laughs> Would you do it again? I'll do it again. Yeah. Would you do it again? Yeah. Guys, there's kids up here. There are kids. There's like seven year olds who did what we, oh, look at how cute they are. Y'all better be in love. I feel that. All right, y'all, we out. See you at the house. Bye. All right, you guys, so unfortunately we are leaving today. Yesterday was the longest day. We spent literally like, I want to say 15 hours, kind of, at the park. We were there all day. So when by the time we got back to our Airbnb, it was nighttime, so I didn't get to show you guys our tiny home. So let me give you a little room tour of the tiny house that we stayed in while we were in Yosemite area. So outside has like a little grill. You could take a bath out here if you wanted. I wasn't finna indulge in that because I don't know who Cheek's been on here. We have a little sitting area for you, which I thought was really cute. And little hot tub vibes. But moving on to the house, so this is a view of our tiny home. Let's bring you guys inside. I have little step stools here. And just for the outside so far, have a nice little door. You can have like a little vibe out here. Got some stools. <coughs> Got some stools. Door's really cute. Thank you. So this is the living room. It has all these open windows. It's very cute. Got a little seating area. There's my husband, <laughs> and it has a TV for you. Chandelier, mm, cute. DVDs. Yeah, they have DVDs. <laughs> and here's the other side of the house. Full view. The kitchen is really cute. Here's the kitchen. Come on, countertops. They have like a nice little, little section over here for your morning coffee and all that fun stuff. And this is the big window, so while you're washing dishes, you can look out into the nothingness. Watch the kids playing. They do have a bathroom. The bathroom is, it's small, but you know, it gets the job done. It's a little messy in there because like I said, we're leaving, we're not just getting here. So this is what the bathroom looks like. Towel holder, here's the toilet, little mini sink, mirror, hey. And here's the bathtub or the shower. And the water was nice and hot, child. Then go upstairs. And upstairs is where we were sleeping. Upstairs, oh, 
thank you. And all that's up here is just the bed. This is where we slept. Luckily, me and Jonathan were not the tallest people in the world, so, you know, and even if you are tall, though, you're not up here to stand. You just, you crawl up here, and you just go right into the bed, so. No issues. Got a little fan for us over here. This is the house, and Jonathan's gonna show you his favorite part of the house. All right, everybody, so welcome into our house, <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna show you my favorite part. You see, this window is not just a window as it appears. <laughs> it uh, actually has a little wrinkle to it. Uh, <laughs> a little wrinkle. If you just push right Whoa. there. Vibe. Hydraulic lift on the window, isn't it beautiful? Now, <laughs> you get a beautiful view of outside, the bar view, if you want to cook something and put mm -hmm. it out there yeah. for the common man, mm -hmm. that's the way to do it. Oh, you look good in this lighting. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> so yeah, if you want to have a little vibe. We didn't get to enjoy this part that much because we were never here. So, but we're leaving now. So this was our home that we stayed in for about four hours and now it's time to go <laughs> to our next location. The adventure continues. The adventure continues, babes. Ta-ta. San Fran, we're back. Did you miss us? Because we missed you. All right, guys, so we just made it back to San Francisco. It was a three hour drive. I did drive 30 minutes of it. Mm -hmm. I'm doing my part, thank you. But we're about to return the rental car, so babe's getting some gas. And then we don't really have any major plans for today. Y'all. <laughs> really the last time we're all together, the whole family's together. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Today's the last day that Jonathan's brother and his girlfriend Alexa, who's also my friend, are gonna be here. Parents are leaving tomorrow as well. So this is like our last day that we can. All right. The last thing we can be together as a family, so we're probably just gonna do lunch and just sightsee a little bit. Tomorrow we're going to Napa because we're going wine tasting, and then Sunday is our last full day here. We're gonna be by ourselves, and then we leave on Monday. Oh, I'm out of breath. Jonathan and I, we got a little sick. I don't know if I said that already, but we got a little sick. But we're making it through. <laughs> so yeah. That's where we're at now. Sorry I like left you guys hanging for like four days of the vacation, but to be honest, y'all didn't miss anything. Like, I I showed you what was important, and then like the little three days in between, we were just fooling around, hanging out with our friends. Like, you missed absolutely nothing. And I'm bringing you guys along with the important stuff. Yeah, look at my man. Yeah, pump that gas, babe. Baby, I got plans for you. That's not how it's on us. I don't got no hand sanitizer to give him when he get back in here, so don't touch me. Y'all don't be mad at me, but um, I'm over these braids already. I don't deserve a protective style. I'm no, I'm learning that. Like I don't deserve protective styles because nine days in, I'm like, all right, yeah, get off, <laughs> get off my head. You know, I don't deserve these. I deserve not these. No, it's still pretty, but I'm just kind of over it already. I'm like. Braids again? Every morning I wake up, I'm like, I got braids still? Like, can we wrap it up? Time for a middle part bust out, you know what I mean? Okay, bye. All right, you guys, we made it to San Fran, and finally, we are, like, we've been living in the slums. Not like big slums, because our last room is cute. Let's put this up right here. Our last room is cute, but it was a tiny house, so it was, like, very small. Not much place to even do a cartwheel if we wanted to, but we just got to our final destination. We'll be here today, Saturday, Sunday and Monday. Okay, so we'll be, we'll be in this room for the next four days. And this one is my style to a T. Okay, so let's give you a quick little room tour. I didn't know that Jonathan was gonna book us the corner room. You know, the corner room gives you the best lighting. So let me show you guys. It is Pride Month, so I'm looking at a very large um, like pride flag. But you know what? It's actually giving God the promise flag. So how about that? Yeah. It's giving windows okay it's giving seats it's giving big bed to do grown people things yeah all right we have a mirror okay because what the last um our first airbnb one bathroom eight people no floor to ceiling mirror okay needed that and just look at all this space come in look so nice and here's our family look at the city me too. This is so nice. Me too. <laughs> Me too. <I> <laughs> and then. 
And this is our bathroom. Let's see. Mm -hmm. <gasps> nice. We got a window in our bathroom. Like, how crazy is that? Y'all trying to see my goodies in the bathroom? <laughs> and then here is our shower and the toilet. Mm, mm, mm. I love it. I love it here. This is my favorite. <sighs> All right, you guys, we're going out to explore the city. I'm a city girl, so you already know this is my vibe. So, we outside. Jonathan is my tour guide. This is exactly how he looked in uh, New York. I want to leave my hand. Oh, you taking public transportation? I know. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> we did it. Successful adventure. <laughs> so cute. This guy's right up on gay. Parque. <laughs> <laughs> so are we cringe? Super cringe. <laughs> Good morning. It's so pretty outside. Good morning, you guys. We are, well, I am getting ready to head to Napa Valley to go wine tasting. <laughs> Very excited about that. Okay, so I don't feel sick anymore. Like, my body feels back to normal, which, thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. It was just like a, a day and a half of feeling sick, but I still sound sick. And one thing about me, I'm going to sneeze. I'm gonna sneeze, okay? So, everybody stay away from me. All right, so we need to be out of here by like 8, 10. It's 7.45, could be worse. I'm gonna refresh my edges really quick. Okay, I think I may have found my girl. Hmm? Because I did these last night. Okay, this side is struggling a little bit, but last night, hello? Okay, it's coming off a little bit, but that's not bad. It's not bad for me at all. So I really wanted to do my makeup in front of the window because it looks great, but I forgot that I didn't carry an actual mirror. So this will be my mirror today. I'm gonna sit it up on my setting spray and we're gonna make it do what it do. This is actually working out well, okay. All right, so let's get ready. Jonathan went downstairs to get us some breakfast. There's transportation picking us up, but it's a two hour ride. And I'm not trying to go wine tasting hungry, so. Jonathan's like, I will get us some food. You get ready, cause I know how you are and He's not wrong. He is not wrong at all. I feel like I need, I wanna cut my edges. I'm starting to think everybody out here with these little cutesy edges, those not your baby hairs for real. Y'all are cutting them. I'm onto you guys, I'm onto you. And I don't care. If that's what you're doing, that's fine, but what, let me know so I could, you know, I could be on it too because mine, like they're okay, but I want it a little bit more. I want a little bit more. So my thoughts on California so far, I like it here a lot. I think so far, I didn't get to go to San Diego. My in-laws and my brother-in-law, <laughs> they stopped at San Diego, but we went straight to Yosemite because we knew we were gonna wake up early for that hike. So we went straight to Yosemite, so we didn't go to, go to San Diego, but I heard that that is the best city so far that we've been to out here. But I love San Francisco so far. I don't know, I just like, I'm such a city girl. You could have taken me to any city and I would have been like, oh yeah. This is it. But I just love being in the city. I love walking to like our destination. Like, oh, you want some coffee? Okay, I'm just gonna walk downstairs 
and go up a block and I'll get you some coffee. <laughs> that's like, that's my thing. Should I set these? I haven't really been setting my edges and it's been staying, so. Why mess up a good thing? Hmm? I don't know. I'm not going to lie, y'all. I just don't think I was meant to stay in Florida. I really don't. I'm telling you right now. I'm telling you right now. If I was not married, <laughs> I would have been out. I would have been out. Let me tell you. I would have been out because I'm such a like, this is, Florida is just not my scene. It's not my scene. And I know I can always go to Miami. Like Miami is the city, but my, but first of all, the weather. Girl, I was wearing two sweaters last night and we are in summer. Is it summer yet? This is, this is my kind of weather. And in South Florida right now, girl, if you put on a sweater, you're dead. You're, say goodbye. Say goodbye to your friends and family. It's over. Also, guys, my lashes. It looks like I have on mascara, but really it's just lash glue from the clusters that I put on. I took them off two days ago. I have washed my face like five times since then, and the glue is gluing. It's not coming off. It's just not coming off. So at this point, I'm like, okay, girl, you won. You kind of look like mascara a little bit, except for it looks like this part over here is so stuck together. I wish I could like separate them. Can I? No, I can't. You know, I always think I have so much time. I woke up at 7 a.m. And I was like, ah, we're going to be downstairs until 8, like 8.15. I don't need an hour and 15 minutes to get ready. Girl, yes, you do. Yes, you do. Not because it takes me an hour and 15 minutes to get ready, but like I woke up, I had to wash my face, brush my teeth, use the bathroom. I had to steam my dress and then Jonathan asked me to steam his shirt. I knew I was going to be vlogging. I know I have to do my hair. Girl, you need an hour and 15 minutes. Like... Why do I keep lying to myself? <laughs> Stop lying. Okay, on Instagram, I was doing like a Q&A and somebody asked me what was my favorite part of my trip so far. And at first, like I told her, I'm like, it's only been, the trip was only halfway done, but I was like so ecstatic that like, I was with all my friends. We made it out the group chat. Like we've been talking about this trip for a while. Please hold. I ain't gonna lie, the last lady who did my eyebrows really made them cousins. Like, at, before they were sisters, but they're so, they're cousins now. Like, this one's kind of sharper, and this one's like more round. You see that? And now that I showed you, you're not gonna unsee it, so please stop looking. <laughs> Definitely giving cousins. Cousins on their daddy's side, like, barely related. Alright, we're gonna skip foundation today, as always. Y'all need to hurry up. Jonathan gonna come back from giving me breakfast, and he gonna be like, ma'am. And I'm going to be like, sir, y'all, Jonathan almost popped my head off last night because after dinner, we went to dinner with his family and then we all split up because Jonathan loves jazz music. Like he'll listen to jazz music at home, but the one he listens to is like, like, in, like big scat vibes. And I'm like, ah, I'm more of like a vibey jazz music type person, but we do both love to listen to live music so last night he found a jazz club so we're like cool we'll go by ourselves what am i doing i don't know still like i'm not 100 percent sure what i'm doing but we're just we're just doing it you know so we went by ourselves we get there and i see people at the front door checking ids and i'm like oh my god jonathan and it was like a 14 minute walk which is not that far but it was kind of cold outside <laughs> and i was like oh my gosh babe i left my id at home and he gave me the look of death <laughs> He like went from like a whole like I can't wait to get it. He's like, yeah. I'm like, baby, left my ID at home. He said, I was like, Ugh. I was like, no worries. Maybe they'll take my like a picture of it. No. But also, luckily, luckily, I say this for my own sake. We got to the front and they were like, oh, if you don't have a reservation, like you probably just can't get in tonight because we're at capacity. I'm like, oh, thank you, God. <laughs> thank you. But now we re we made a reservation to go tonight instead. Wait, is this the right one? I'm extremely excited for it, but I just don't know if I'm gonna have the energy because we're gonna be out all day. And um, I'm already tired just thinking about it. I can't even lie to you. Yeah, I didn't even realize I was using my beauty blender because I was talking at the same time. Hi, honey. Coffee? Oat milk. Oat milk, huh? Thank God. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, that looks so good. What is that? Let's see how it. 
I know, but what is it? Egg, bacon, and <sighs> Sounds good. I was telling them how you gave me the look of death last night when I forgot my ID. <laughs> you know, Jonathan's eating right now. He doesn't tend to believe y'all. Oh, I didn't realize the camera was still recording. No. <laughs> I was like, oh. Cool. <laughs> cool. <laughs> but yeah, mm. if it was the first time, it'd be one something. When it's the 17th time, you're just like, can you please get your life together? <laughs> he said, be so serious. <laughs> Mm, my bad. Not being serious. Not at all. Very serious. Now, am I seeing things or is there a patch right here? Like right here? There's a freaking patch. What? Do you see a patch right here? A patch of makeup? Mm hmm Yeah. It won't go away. The more I like blend it, the lighter it's getting. It's kind of crazy. I like this color. Cheeks. Bring it down a little bit. Okay, I forgot I was saying something. So yeah, somebody asked like, what's my favorite part of the trip so far? And originally, I was saying the fact that we all made it out the group chat. But now, so far, I don't know. Like, I just really love seeing the the mountains at Yosemite. That was just like a a very crazy experience like it was so beautiful the hike itself no the hike i actually really enjoyed the hike it made me feel like accomplished yes like I, i'm like oh i'm that girl but um the way down really really got me tight i'm not gonna lie i'm like okay i hate it here I'm like though you would think that the walk up is harder and maybe it is but the walk down or the hike down is just much more annoying it's like you have zero control of your body because it's just like it has you just feeling like you know those balloon things there's actually one outside that like has the body moving like this that's how i felt going down i'm like why can't i control my legs so i kind of got i'm like this is annoying and there's not as much to see on the way down and you've already accomplished what you came here accomplished so now i kind of just feel like oh get me out of here and i would have canceled because that morning i was feeling pretty sick and i didn't think i was gonna make it but to be honest that hike actually made me feel so much better i don't know why but I felt so good during that hike. Okay, let's just kind of blend everything together. <laughs> Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now. Sanjuvesi, and it's a Chianti style Sanjuvesi. Has about uh, three weeks of skin contact as opposed to the previous Italian wine. This is what they're gonna recommend with like, so awesome. what do you guys think about it? Okay, Thank cool. you. Sanjuvesi. Three weeks of skin contact. Yeah. 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 Welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. This is our Tesoro. It's a blend of Sangiovese, Cabernet Sauvignon, and Syrah. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, don't cap. <laughs> you never know. Actually, never know. That's true. It's Sunday. Uh, Jess, give the people an idea of what we've done today. Okay. We went to breakfast. We went back to the hotel to sleep for like, you know, well, I slept. Jess you know slept for I mean? like two hours. <laughs> was awake. Even though it was his idea to go back to the hotel. I sleep. can't really, I don't know. Renette, napping feels wrong. I got stuff to do. And then we went to the botanical gardens. No. Japanese tea garden. Yeah. And now we're walking through the garden, well, a park. They don't have parks like this. Well, maybe they do, but I don't feel like this. No, nah, the weather's so great. It feels so good, you guys. I'm moving here. I don't know where Jonathan's going, but I'm moving here. There's uh, a lot more uh, people like us in Atlanta. Oh, for yeah, sure. they're not like us out here, I'll tell you that right now. No, it's so funny, this one guy. Yeah, this one guy, he walked up to us and he goes, What's up, black people? And he was black, what's up, black people? He was black. Yeah, he was like, like, What's up, black people? He was actually the only you know, black person I saw for like the past like 30 minutes before that. Every time we see a black person, they always like give us that yeah, nod. Yeah, it's like respect. Like, when we went hiking, someone gave us a whole dap up. We're like, it's nice to see some black people out here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's not, uh, yeah. not normal. They're not out here. But uh, everyone's really nice, though. I haven't felt any like stares or like, racism or whatever. Oh, there's a vi Oh, the skate park. Ooh. Yeah, my cousin was telling me that basically they pr priced out all the black people. Yeah. And they moved them, sent them all to Oakland. Well, yeah, that's unfortunate. But it's a nice city. the people who are left are very nice. Everyone's been really nice. Service has been nice. Weather is nice. Food's been good. Food's been fantastic. Go. Really, and really good. It's just a beautiful place. It's a very beautiful place. All right, I'm about to get copyrighted, so I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye. <laughs> Yo, look at our driver. It's nobody. <laughs> our problem is it's not Jonathan. He's not doing anything. Look about no hands. No hands. It's literally just driving. Very futuristic. Also kind of scary. It's kind of a vibe, I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> Nobody to talk to, we just vibing. Yeah, this is way better than a Uber. If they got a whisper. I know, or like some random person talking to you to make a conversation. Y'all, it's crazy. Y'all see that the steering wheel turning? It's like legit doing its own thing. Crazy.